Hi, my name is Olivia Bainbridge. I am a caffeine addict. I have been sober for roughly 30 days. We, my group attended a AA meeting a couple of days ago, and the AA meeting consisted of a guy named Tony introducing his story and sharing his, who is it? He's in recovery and he's been sharing his story about how he's been in recovery for uh, nine, six years, I think. And the chairman of the the meeting, he gave everyone the opportunity to speak about what they wanted, like anything they wanted to contribute to the meeting. And they got to talk about like the readings of the day and all that. And at the end of the meeting, it was concluded with a script from the AA book. I'm Jaden Gray and my addiction is caffeine. I've been sober for 32 days. Um, regarding any literature we found, um, for all the groups that we chose to look up, the only literature was the AA Alcoholics Anonymous book. Um, for Smart Recovery, Woman for Sobriety, and Al-Anon, there was no literature to go with them. My name is Michaela Adams, and I'm a nail-biting addict, and I'm coming up on 60 days. So for what's helpful about these meetings is that it creates a relatable atmosphere for people going through addiction and they can find people with similar stories or different stories and know that they're not alone in their recovery. I'm Matthew Moseman. I'm a caffeine addict. I, um, I've been roughly sober for 35 days now. Um, and just some like general info and um, helpful advice that was said during the meeting was um, the quote was a puppy will be a puppy. And this is kind of good advice for like mindfulness and acceptance in one's own life, whether that be with addiction or just with anxiety and stress in general. So um, I feel like that advice is pretty generalizable.